Hey Destiny, my name is Sean and in this video I'm going to show you three things you can do today to help bring in more customers to your business. Most likely you're sitting there asking yourself why would I be doing this and what's in it for me? Well, you're lucky because I read minds and the answer is oftentimes in the world of the internet most local business owners are too busy running their business to learn how the internet can benefit them and their company. And sometimes the only hesitation that someone has of hiring someone is they don't know who the expert is. So I found myself giving out a free attack plan so that people can actually use it and impact their business for free. This has resulted in some of the local business owners raising their hands and saying, hey Sean, I, I like you and uh, you, can you please do this for me? So uh, if by the end of this video you like it, what you heard and you like what I've, what I've showed you, uh, please shoot me a message back and we can chat or if by the end you simply just want to take this free attack plan I gave you and, and implement it yourself, that works for me too. So uh, let me go over the three things to show you what you can do for your company and your competition to beat your competition and not waste any of your time or mine. So the first thing I want to go over is the content. Google is looking to have about 1500 words on, on your page of content um, to, to help rank. So there is some uh, improvement on it you can do right now with that. So increasing the content will help you get more keywords, which is something I'll cover in a, a few minutes here, and will help uh, Google rank your site faster and easier compared to your competition. So I do have your competition pulled up, so I'll just hop over there. You see they've got a little bit more content maybe, but uh, the point being is there it's very beatable. So um, something very simple for you to do would be to add content with specific keywords in there that people are searching for. So now I'm going to jump over to just a Google search. I, I look for kitchen remodeling in Lexington, Kentucky. And of course, the first thing you see is the ads, which people are paying for and is a good way to get customers. But then you see the map pack, and I, I did not see you guys in the map pack, which is a, a big deal. And one, one of the major driving factors of this is um, organic ranking, which is, you know, down here. We'll, we'll go over that. And then also citations, which is just the simple address, your address, your phone number, and the name of your business being posted in, you know, yellow pages or Facebook or any kind of directories like that. So increasing your citation count is important and you want to beat out your, your uh, customers on that. So, so there's that. And uh, of course, Kitchen Concepts in Kentucky is your main competition and I, I did show you their website. So they're number one. I did go through the first page and I, I didn't see you guys on the, the first page. Um, so, and you see that ads are down here too and uh, you're your main competitor also has ads, so uh, they're they're trying to take the market share, and, and I believe they are with being at the top of uh, the map pack, which gets about 35% of the clicks, and then most of the rest of the clicks are going down to this guy, the first organic listing. So uh, a couple other things uh, we want to take a look at while we're here. So I've got this tool pulled up, and this is... Uh, called Arifs, you can get it. It does cost about, I want to say it's like $160 a month or so. And what it does is it pulls up all the information that Google uses to rank your website. So just to kind of touch on it, this is the actual rankings. So um, four, these are out of 100. So 14 out of 100 and 3.5 out of 100. And these are based on a number of variables and we won't have to get all, into all the details. But one of the things is backlinks, which is just a, a big term for other links from other websites linking back to your website. So if you think of like a blog, um, someone writing about the best kitchen modeling, remodeling done ever, and they link back to your website just to give you some credit, that would be a backlink. Referring domains is just a fancy word for websites. So there's 13 other websites referring back to your website. So you have 169 keywords, which is a lot for as little content you have. So that's something you might want to work on. Adding more content to make sure you're getting the um, right number of keywords per 
you know, so many words in your content so that Google doesn't dock you for it because they will actually dock you. Uh, it's called keyword stuffing and it's a, uh, it's looked upon negatively. So, so that's one thing. And then just to pull up your uh, competition here, they've got a lot more backlinks, which a lot more links and a lot more uh, websites referring back to them. And they do have more keywords as well. So, uh, but a lot of it's their name, right? So anyways, uh, so there are several things you can do. Uh, just to kind of recap, the three major things that you should be working on is the content, increasing the amount of content and the keywords that you're using. Increase the number of citations to get into the map pack or to rank in the map pack and you want to get into it, which is GMB. If you search Google search for GMB, it'll be in there. And then the, the last thing is the backlinks and making sure you're getting good quality links is very important. All right, so that's all I got, Destiny. Please let me know what you think of the video. Uh, I hope this is helpful for you and uh, look forward to talking to you soon. Thanks.